Hello and welcome to another exciting show of On The Yard. I'm your host, Brittany. And I'm your host, Amari. On today's show, we're giving out tips to help the freshman class of 2014 get through their first year of college. That's right. We here at On The Yard know how difficult it is for freshmen to make the transition to college. So we have some tips you might like and later we're going to hear from your peers as we went on the yard to the cafeteria to hear what they had to say. Tip number one, if you're lost on campus or have a question, simply ask someone. Tip number two, if you have a car on campus, park where your parking sticker requires you or you will get a ticket. <laughs> Tip number three is a good one. Watch out for the freshman 15. It says you can gain up to 15 pounds if you don't watch what you eat, so count your calories. But that's just what they say. Hmm. Tip number four, make sure you pack what you need because packing can be a big hassle. And Tip number five, get off to a good start by studying hard to pass those classes. You don't want to be behind when finals rolls around. Mm -hmm. Well, that's all the tips we have for you here in the studio. Let's take things on the yard now to see what's on the minds of the freshman class of 2014. Okay, so we're here with Gina and Janelle. I caught them before they made their way into the cab. So I'm gonna start with asking Gina questions first. Gina, how does it feel to be a freshman at the University of Maryland Eastern Shore? I'm happy I came here, I was prepared and yeah. Wonderful. Janelle, so which dorm do you stay in? I stay in UT. Ah, the best dorm. So Janelle, <laughs> do you have a good roommate? I do. Best roommate of all. Three Hamilton, aka Nemo. Yes. Okay, wonderful. So if you had to give advice to freshman girls that are going to come in next year about roommates, what would you tell them? Uh, well, me and my roommate were already prepared. We talked over our summer. It's pretty much it. Make sure you talk, get to know each other. Great. Okay, wonderful. So Gina, how are you preparing yourself for your sophomore year? Well, I study, uh, I research, I talk to other upperclassmen and they just prepare me. My sister went here already. She's a sophomore now. So. Great, great. Okay, and Janelle, how about yourself? How are you preparing yourself for your sophomore year? Uh, not much to prepare other than finish doing my grind, classwork, schoolwork. Waking up every morning doing what I need to do. Okay, so this question is for both of you. Was there anything that you wanted to know prior to coming to college that you feel like no one elaborated on? No. No? Not really. Not really? <laughs> okay. Well, thank you so much for your time, ladies. Thank you. Hi, Devon. How are you? I'm good. How about yourself? I'm great. Thank you for asking. Devon, do you feel like you were prepared for college before you got here? Um... As far as like mentally and school goes, I think I was. I wasn't prepared for like the school to be as like as fun as it is. I thought it was gonna be kind of boring, but um, I was pleasantly surprised when I got here. It's a lot of things to do. Um, I really enjoy the campus. So that's great. That's wonderful. Um, so what are you preparing yourself for for next semester? Um, next semester, I'm trying to keep going with my business major. Um, I'm trying to get my grades up because right now I got a couple C's and I need to get rid of that. But as far as everything else, I'm just keep going with how everything is now. That's great. So if you had to give freshmen advice that are going to come in next year, what advice would you give those freshmen? Don't bring a boyfriend or a girlfriend and bring a lot of money. <laughs> Thank you very much, Devon. No that was some great advice. Hello, Hawk family. I'm your girl, Sandra J, right here on The Yard. Now, I have standing here a coop. And you're a freshman. Yeah. Okay. How are you enjoying your experience here at UMES as a freshman? I mean, I'm enjoying it. I'm liking it. I'm, uh, I know a lot of people that go here that are sophomores right now, so they're kind of like, you know, helping me have a better experience here okay. as a freshman. I'm, I'm liking it. I'm enjoying it. Okay. Are you managing your work well as well as the activities that you're doing here on campus? Uh, pretty much, yeah. I don't have a lot of activities as, as of yet because, you know, it's just like the seventh week. But uh, everything's going pretty straight. Okay. I'm liking it. Are you planning on joining any organizations on campus, like track and field or the D club or something? I mean, soccer is all I do, but they don't have that. But uh, I'm looking, I'm looking for it though, to join in something, hopefully in the future. Well, thank you for joining us right here on the yard. Hey, we're here with Cameron. Hey, Cameron, how you doing? Pretty good, pretty good. Good. All right. So, how how did you prepare to come to uh, before coming to college? How did you prepare? Um, well, when I first graduated. I knew it was going to be a lot of work coming to college. I didn't know how much work exactly, but I made sure I studied and stayed on top of what I had to do. So what are some of the things that you're going to do to uh, prepare for next semester? Um, 
I'm definitely going to look into more computer science like uh, ideas and jobs and all that stuff. Right. See where, um, how much more I can learn. Because when I first came, I wasn't really that, you know, I wouldn't, I didn't know that much about it. But it was interesting from my past experiences. So I'm just trying to develop into more skills and. Just learn about more. That's more right. skills, more internships, definitely. And if you need any help, you can just let all me right. know, man. Omari, all right? All right. Thanks. Take it easy. All right. Hey, Hawk family, it's Omari again. I'm here with my boy, Irvin. Hey. How you feeling? Feeling good, feeling good. Where you from, Irvin? Carroll County, Maryland. Carroll County, Maryland. All right, Irvin, what are some of the tips that you might uh, advise your, your own freshman class of 2014 um, for uh, coming into college, or the first year coming into college? Ah, uh, man, you got to focus. It's the first year. You can't just, like, decide to party. I mean, there's a lot of stuff going on campus, right. a lot of activities, but you got to stay focused. You got to maintain, like, a good GPA and all that good stuff. That's good. That's good. I like to hear that. So so what are some of the things that you do to stay focused uh, here for your first year, based on your experience so far? Uh, I try to stay away from the girls, even though they're everywhere. Yeah. Uh, stay in my room, focus, uh, just do my homework, just stay ahead of the game. No, that's a good answer. We like that, man. So uh, tell me, prior to coming to college, do you think you were prepared for it? Uh, probably not mentally, but okay. I, I was pretty prepared for it physically. Like, I, I run for track team, feeling good doing that. Uh, high school, I didn't do so good, so I wanted to step it up in college. And that's, those are good answers, man. And a lot of people, they're trying to do what you do. You know, they're not doing so well in high school, but coming to college, you know, they try to prepare and get well. And get your stuff together, bro. Yeah. All right, cool. My boy, Irvin, Omari, on New York. Let's talk. So how'd you enjoy the interviews, Amari? God, the interviews were amazing. How'd you enjoy? I feel like they were very great. Like I met some new freshmen that I would never think I would encounter right here on campus. So. Yeah, me too. I met a lot of young, interesting, and intelligent young people. That's good to hear. Freshman class looks bright and amazing. And a bright future for them too. Yeah. So. Well, here we are, signing off from on the yard. I'm the boy Omari. And I'm your girl Sandra J. Peace. That was a lot of fun, Amari. Kind of reminded me of when I was a freshman. <laughs> yeah, me too. Shout out to the freshman class of 2014 for being such good sports. The month of October has some events that you might want to check out. There's the Midnight Madness on Friday, October 15th in the Heights Gymnasium. That's right. Then there's the Miss Black and Gold Scholarship Pageant on October 18th, hosted by the brothers of Alpha Phi Alpha Fraternity Incorporated. Now, today's email comes from Joy out of Prince George's County, Maryland, and it reads, I'm having problems with writing my papers. Where should I go to get help? Hmm. Well, Joy, you should stop by the Writing Center, located on the first floor of Wilson Hall, room 1107. They'll be more than happy to help you. And we would like to end today's show with a quote of the day from James M. Barry. The secret of happiness is not in doing what one likes, but in liking what one has to do. Well, until next time, I'm Omari. And I'm Brittany, signing off from On the Yard. Peace.